The Bemidji High School gymnastics team finished third at sectionals last season. New faces on the team has given the Lumberjacks an unexpected boost. I visited practice to learn more about these limber Lumberjacks. The Lumberjacks gymnastics team has lost two big contributors from last season in Jessica Burnquist and Brooke Beck. The Jacks have found replacements from a variety of sources with two seniors, two juniors and two sophomores, all of whom take their roles seriously. You really don't have to say much to them, they'll just get out of your way and, <laughs> and get to work. We work new skills and we do it over and over and over again until it becomes muscle memory. The number one strength of the team comes in the vault where Bemidji is led by senior Alicia Moe and junior Haley Gregg. One pleasant surprise on the team was the addition of Haley Gregg, who switched from competing in club gymnastics to being part of the high school team. She's really proven to be one of the leaders uh, as far as uh, her abilities and her, you know, just her attitude and her scoring in that. Gregg says the high school team is less nerve-wracking than the super intense environment of a club gymnastics meet. When I'm not like as nervous, I don't like think about falling as much. So I try to like, think about like, oh, this is like practice, it'll be fine. One area that has seen a great deal of improvement from the beginning of the season is the balance beam. They want to do difficult skills and if you tumble on the beam, it's only four inches wide and it's, it's hard. If the girls are going to make a run in the postseason, they'll need to increase their scores on the uneven bars. There are a whole bunch of people trying to just fill, get in all of the fundamentals that they need you know, to, to fill in the event requirements. Trying to get higher level skills and make my routine flow more smooth. If the team can smooth out those wrinkles, maybe they can dance into the state tournament. The Lumberjacks next dual meet comes January 31st against Park Rapids Monaga Nevis. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.